welcome back to another video and by this time it's fairly obvious that the banana pi m64's operating system collection is not very good so they do have android which kind of works but the ubuntu uh, distributions are just a joke so they don't work at all i've had so many problems with them i have made a video about it so if you want to see what all problems i did have you can go ahead and check that out uh, so they are basically dependent upon a modified build of the Raspbian OS and that actually works okay except for the fact that it is based on ARM v6 architecture so all the pa packages are ARM v6 apart from being 32 bit they aren't even uh, based on ARM v7 architecture leave alone ARM v8 so that means you are losing a lot of your CPU capabilities uh, in l more or less ways so I went ahead and tried to get some information about this on Ambien Ambien is a group effort to uh, have a stable desktop uh, Linux build on the single board computers especially the ones based on and around the ARM architecture so I went ahead there and they were not at all interested in initially supporting uh, this device specifically due to the all winners all winner not really being interested in releasing a lot of the source code for the uh, a64 cpu that is in the banana pi m64 but luckily for me uh, ambien had supported uh, the pine 64 which has exactly the same cpu and actually it boots perfectly fine so what you are seeing is uh, my ambient build with a desktop environment based on Debian Jesse it has uh, complete support for uh, ARM64 architecture all the packages and the kernels are ARM64 and they are work fine it's stable from what I've used it for it's not a very long time I've used it for but it seems stable and works just fine so apart from the fact there are around four things that are still missing wi-fi support bluetooth support emmc support and gpu drivers now again these are all the things that are sort of you know pending partner support so uh all winner still has to release certain sources and documentation on these things before anyone could get them working so do not expect even in the upcoming builds uh, not from me by anyone uh, on this machine to have support for these four things apart from that this is a really stable build a huge shout out to all the people who have worked on the ambient builds so far and the download link would be in the description so go ahead and check that out and thank you so much for watching and I'll be seeing all of you in the next one